Right, hi everyone and welcome back to all my 78s. This is a, an unboxing uh, 78 that I bought from eBay. I had a, a search on it for a, pff, quite a long time, probably about three years, two or three years. And um, it suddenly popped into my email box that there was a copy going for sale. And this was um, basically... Um, uh, how I started collecting 78s. The artist here is uh, is uh, part of a, quite a, a few, I've got quite a few of his already, and um, British artist, very famous, um, especially during the uh, the 30s and the war years, um, and uh, very famous for. Uh, a particular instrument and had a catchphrase was a comedian I, I suspect a lot of you have guessed what already who it is um, that's hopefully it's all in one piece so it's uh, not looking too bad um, pizza box I find pizza boxes are usually the way that people like to send them <laughs> um, yeah uh, so let's try and get into this very carefully and uh, and see what it is. But uh, I hope you've all had a nice day because it turned out nice today. I can tell you, it turned out nice for me. I have got some news. Um, we're going to be doing some some vlogging news on, on different items. Maybe not so much to do with uh, 78. So I'm going to call it. I'm going to call them from now on. Um, off the record. I thought that might be uh, a good uh, a good title. Anyway, let's get this open. And plenty of, of uh, bubble wrap around it. The bubble wrap doesn't really do that much to protect these records, to be honest with you. Um, so now we have to try and. Uh, Try and open them there without break. You can actually break a 78 simply by so it might not even be broken. And if you if you're really not careful, you could break a 78 simply by just opening the packaging that it comes in. It's got plenty of stiffeners, probably. I uh, shall keep some of these stiffeners because I've got some to post myself. But let's see if we're getting it anywhere. Yeah, it doesn't seem to want to. Oh, maybe you've got to do this side here. Uh, <laughs> Come on, open up. Please open up. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Is it in one piece? Oh, yes. It is. Um, a little bit of sticky. Oh, there we are. There we are to it oh great here it is in one piece it looks it's in one piece on the Decca label and it's in okay condition uh i'd say that was in good condition so on the a side we have she's never been seen since then by george formby can we get this to uh there we go by George Formby. On the other side, now this is the this is the song I wanted, and it's "Swimming with the Women" again by George Formby. And uh, yeah, I'm I'm a I have been a fan. I've got quite a few George Formbys. Let's hope get this back into focus. And um and and this is one I hadn't got, and it's on the Decca label, which means it's an early George Formby. And uh, an original issue. It's got a little bit of a sticker on there. And on that side as well. 468. But, um, hmm, don't know why people do that for. Well, that's not something I... But I don't mind stamps, original tax stamps being on them. But I, I, I get a bit annoyed when if you find these sort of little stickers that some collectors put on there. There's no need for that. But there you go. That is as it is. I shall be playing it uploading it very soon so thanks for watching this unboxing and another 
successful post from eBay. That's great when that happens. So thanks again for watching and I'll catch you again soon. Bye for now.